The archetypes are those beings that we share in our collective consciousness as human beings. And the archetypes um, move through time and space and basically shift and adapt to the time. So they, they move, they're basically healing guideposts for humanity. So Isis and Osiris are some of my very favorite archetypes. I love these two, and I love the balance of the sacred masculine and the sacred feminine. I'm basically working with a fusion of Asian and European techniques. So I'm working with things like powdered lapis, um, powdered mica, and I can show you. I actually have some mica here that I went and collected from the mica mines over by Ojo Caliente. So this is um, the way the artists have gotten color in the East and the West really since the beginning. So earth pigments and semi-precious gems and minerals, all of these things are, um, are ways in which I'm making the work happen. These two paintings, they're a diptych. They're actually on linen. And these are called light echo. So it's Osiris and Isis. And this is basically the sacred masculine and the sacred feminine energies. These are comprised all and composed around sacred geometry. And each piece has the sacred geometry within it by itself. And then there's all this geometry happening between the two of them. So for instance, you know, you have the mandalas here matching, you know, so she's, the, the feminine is sort of the, the darker energy, almost like an eclipse energy and the light is going down into the earth. And then the masculine energy is the solar energy here, the light energy, and his light is moving up towards heaven. So this is just one of the, of the symbologies that are, that's happening in this piece. And these are done with the pure powdered earth pigments um, that I was talking about a moment ago. So lots of powdered lapis, um, powdered indigo that I actually brought back from Egypt. Um, powdered cobalt, lots of powdered mica from Oho, um, you know, the, the umbers and the siennas, and this is basically earth. So, and then moving through, you know, semi-precious stones and mica. So that's what's going on here. Um, these are both over 100 layers deep, and I, I'm not sure what the light looks like on them right now, but the idea is, is that they're totally changing throughout the day, depending on what the light in the room is doing. I felt that they needed to be colossal. So these are actually eight feet tall each. And then when they hang um, together like this, it spans 10 feet across. And they can actually hang, like where they're gonna be exhibited, they're gonna have a bit more space between them. So Isis and Osiris, yeah, the sacred masculine, sacred feminine, and these are multi-dimensional archetypes that are still very popular and prevalent today, even though they come from antiquity. Thank you.